Hey, welcome back to Atreyu News. You'll never guess what state this is happening in. Heavy rain causes parts of Corpus Christi, Texas to flood, leading to flooded out vehicles and impossible to pass roads. I'm surprised it's not in California, the cursed state. <coughs> Breaking suck hands down decision on Bitcoin ETF and it's big. <laughs> I find it hilarious. I was just talking about my Bitcoins because I owned a few of them and I advise people to invest in precious metals and Bitcoins but after this I don't know we'll see how much. My Bitcoins have depreciated in value so maybe hold off on that if you planned on doing it. We'll see what happens. The SEC has rejected the Winklevoss brothers' application for a Bitcoin ETF. After much anticipation and spiked two record highs earlier today, the SEC has decided to reject the Winklevoss application for the Bitcoin ETF. The SEC premise appears to be unregulated nature of the underlying. Based on the record before it, the Commission believes that the significant market for Bitcoin are unregulated. Therefore, as the exchange has not entered into and would currently be unable to enter in the type of surveillance sharing agreement that has been in place with respect to all previously approved commodity trust ETPs, agreements that help address concerns about the potential for fraudulent or manipulative acts and practices in this market. The Commission does not find the proposed rule to change to be consistent with the Exchange Act. What goes up to 1327 comes down hard to 978. Yeah, you can see it. I remember in uh, 2014, I believe it was, Bitcoins were only like 300 and something dollars each, and that's when I purchased them. So, still worth over a thousand dollars, say. That's still a pretty good damn, damn deal. I'm still convinced digital currency is the future. Just a minor setback. I still like the idea. It's pretty hard for the government to try to get their greedy hands on something they can't find or they can't see. Hilarious video shows Professor interrupted by his children during BBC interview. Let's take a watch. Scandals happen all the time. The question is, how do democracies respond to those scandals? Uh, and what will it mean for uh, for the wider region? <laughs> I think one of your children has just walked in. I mean, shift it, shifting shifting sands in the region. Do you think relations with the North may change? Um, I would be surprised if they do. <laughs> the, um, <laughs> pardon me. That's pardon right, me. My apologies. <laughs> <laughs> what is going to be for the region? Uh, that nanny's fired. North, uh, sorry. Um, North Korea, North, uh, South Korea's policy choices on North Korea have been severely limited in the last six months to a year. <laughs> uh, that was awesome.